Day number two, a lot better than yesterday so far. Not a lot of wind, which we will take. A little bit of a later start, that's all right. Wanted to warm up a little bit. We're at about 50 degrees right now. It's gonna be time to take some clothes off here pretty soon. But uh, new guy came along today, the HMG Fenwick with the old uh, Spyrex on there. I'm excited to use that. We got the Stratic on the Shimano. We still got the good old Fenwick. We got some uh, paddle baits that have been sitting in juice for quite some time. And then all of our other standbys. So let's get out of these weeds. I'm paddle out of the weeds here so I don't have to deal with that. And uh, see how this motor goes and go from there. So we'll see what we can get into. I've already seen a couple bass right up here on the edge. So that sounded good. Looked good. Fish on. Not sure if you guys can see the difference here in the motor but we, we switched out the uh, shear pin yesterday we got a new Duralast this is on level five it's uh about as fast as a dude from Jamaica going across the water I tell you what massive 1000 percent difference so I'm excited to see that so it would appear that the battery had basically just crapped out on us which makes sense it's four to five years old marine battery so that was a great sign. I got a little chub from that, so now we got to get some fishing. Actually, casted this worm out, just let it sit, and I was rigging up my other pole, putting a rage crawl on, and I go to reel this in. This guy's sitting down at the other end, so I hope this isn't an inhale job. And it does look like it is. It's probably coming out of his ass by the time I get to it here. Oh boy, what do you got there, buddy? Yep. Well. There's the first one of the day, folks. We're not uh, calling home to mom about it, but we'll take it fish on. All right, howdy, folks. I was uh, just in contact with uh, the boss man, the VANCE, wanted me to get a uh, get an update of the motor here. So he wanted to know what was going on while he's working. And uh, just to make it official, work does suck. I don't care what job you have. But uh, anyway, so he wants a live update, seeing that we were having trouble with the motor about what exactly do we have going on so we're just putzing along here number one number two number three number four and then watch number five on the high seas cruising it's actually impressive so definitely a battery issue it would appear but um, the other main issue right now is that I have drank as many beers as fish that I've caught. So that would be one. And uh, I don't think it's noon yet, but that's all right. That's what we do when we fish. We have fun. So we're going to go cruise around here, take a little look, see, get back to some of the staple points. I have not been on the Suez Canal yet because I'm an idiot. Um, I guess maybe my fishing mind said, hey, let's wait till high noon to do that. But... We're going to go hit up some of these spots over here where I believe that there are fish. It was a little windy earlier and I had my other rods out. I tell you the other thing that's hilarious too is that, you know, I got the Shimano rod with the big money Stratic on it. Got that HMG rod with, uh, what's on there? The Spyrex, the old go-to. This Fluger President on this $60 Fenwick Eagle for what we're doing, in my humble opinion, cannot be beat. So... That's just my two cents. You can take that to the bank and you can throw it in the toilet. But um, check in. Let's get some fish. We're pissing around. Fish on. Hey guys, uh, just want to check in. It's about three o'clock or so after this day of fishing. So let you know what we got going on here and everything. Currently, we, we got three fish in the boat. Have missed seven fish. Um, have uh, switched up tactics here. We got the uh, the Stratic is in full effect with its uh, cousin, the Compre. And um, fishing the tube right now, so it wasn't having any luck at all with the worm or with the paddle bait. Fished a crawfish. Not a touch on that, not even a bluegill. So I said, well, we got some two turn hooks with us. And I said, I got three poles. So 
So why not? Sorry, I was eating a pop tart. No, no, you don't. guys here we go tube time again we got a halfway decent bass on we know how this is going today so not so fast not bad not bad at all boy he's heavy heavy for that size well, chunk off of the point of Vance Island with the tube. We've been to this dance before. I've seen how it has gone. Nice bass, not bad. Oh boy, I thought it got off right there. Let's not take any chances. Get in the boat. There's your 5 p.m. bass. Welcome to Miller time. Well, here's our 5 p.m. update. Beautiful day out. I am probably sunburned again. Total of eight bass, two rock bass have been landed in the boat and at last count I missed seven fish. Uh, out of beer. Working on mountain dews. A little bit of food, still got food left. So we're gonna give this about another hour or so. Weather seems to be holding out okay. Wind is all sort of here and there, nothing major. Battery seems to still be okay. So we're gonna just uh, keep doing what we're doing and uh, see what we can do. So nothing too exciting, but that's where we're at. We're learning a little bit. I didn't think that the tube would be of any factor i thought it was too early in the season for the tube so it shows what the hell i know which is nothing so fish on Holy shit. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh. 
This is a pig. This is definitely my best best bass I've ever caught. Without a doubt. Wow. That is a pig. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate that. Well, thank you for having me. See ya. Well, fishingwithvance.com, that was just the biggest bass I've ever caught. I'm still a little shaken. Uh, texting with it with the captain, with Vance. Vance is going ape shit. <laughs> I did not weigh him. I couldn't make, I don't have a scale. Unless it's in there and I didn't know it, which is fine. He's a freaking pig, though. I know that. I tell you what, it was fun. Whole thing's on camera. There's still fish out there. I'm not sure if you can see them. I think that they're carp. We got a little night bite going on. Gulf Nation. The tube will not be denied on the canal. Little guy. Might be a bluegill. Oh, the little rock bass. Alright. Later, Holmes. Ooh. We're not done yet, folks. Is that another rock bass? Wow, look at this slab. Holy cow. That's beautiful. Beautiful fish. Well guys, another fishing adventure has come to an end today. All in all, a very interesting day. Started out real slow, couldn't catch anything. I think by like 1.30 I had caught two, maybe three fish. Uh, ended up the day with 14 or 15, I'll have to look at the video. 14 or 15, three or four nice rock bass, a dozen regular bass, and of course then the big boy. So, uh, heck of a day, beautiful weather, a little bit of wind. Stratic uh, definitely pulled its weight and got into my good graces. So. All in all, great day. That was fun, I'll tell you what. Fishingwithvance.com